These notes are on Venn diagrams. Um, so Venn diagrams initially can be a bit confusing. Um, so in this Venn diagram, a group of people were surveyed to find out what winter gear they wear when it gets into the 40s, meaning 40 degrees Fahrenheit, so cold. Um, and so the first thing it would be really great to do is to sort of make sense of this diagram. So it turns out that um, the full, there's a full circle on this side where it has 15. And that means that 15 people said yes to hats. And on this side, we have a circle where it talks about scarves. And it actually turns out that 31 people said yes to wearing a scarf. So what does this five in the middle stand for? It stands for the five people who said hats and scarves, which means that this 10 out here means only hat, and this 26 out here means only scarf. And this 45 here means nothing. They didn't wear a hat or a scarf. Some people might find it helpful to make a two-way diagram of this information, and if that's something that you find to be helpful, please, by all means, do that. Um, let's look at some of the information here. Uh, I think the first thing we need to do is we need to actually say that 86 people were surveyed. That's how many people were asked. So let's see um, what the probability Sorry about that, little glitch in technology, there we go. Um, what is the probability that a person wears a scarf and a hat? So we know, as we just discussed, that five people wear a scarf, a scarf and a hat, and that's out of the total. You know, we're talking about how many wear both out of the total, so that's 86 which gives us approximately 5.8%. Another probability um, is we're going to say the probability that someone wears a hat but no scarf. So now I'm looking for the people who are only wearing a hat. So that's another way we could say this. We could say that this is only hat. Either way, those people are sitting here and it's 10 of them. Out of, again, all of the people, 86, which gives us a probability of about 12%. Oh, and I should, there we go. I did on the other one, just didn't on this one. Let's look at one more. Um, let's talk about the probability that a person um, is wearing a hat given that they're wearing a scarf. And we use this notation. So we have given wearing scarf, also hat. So given that they're wearing a scarf, I now need to look at only the portion of the Venn diagram that deals with wearing a scarf. And so having drawn these two circles down here is pretty helpful because now I can see that I'm only talking about 31 people. I've taken just the people who wear a scarf and, and I've set them aside. And of those 31 people, five of them are also wearing a hat. And so I have five out of 31, which is approximately 33%.